How's it going everybody and welcome back to another vlog. So um, I was editing my other videos and the entire day just slipped by me. It's 9.10 and I haven't eaten today, again. So I, I know I said that I'd never do another mukbang, but I'm really hungry today and I changed my mind. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna walk into Chipotle 20 minutes before closing and I'm gonna order a burrito with everything on it. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna get it and as not to bother them, I'm just gonna take it to go and I'm gonna go eat it at home. But I'm gonna order a burrito with everything in it. All the meats, all the sides, all the hot sauces, everything. This is gonna be fantastic. Okay, so I found the nearest Chipotle. I'm walking up to it right now. So it turns out I'm not the only person who showed up 20 minutes before closing. There's still a little bit of a line, but um, there's only two people in front of me. Since it's LA, I'm kind of worried about pointing the camera at anybody because not everybody wants to be on video and I don't have any releases or any of that stuff, so I'm gonna try to keep it on myself as much as possible, but I will show you the creation of my wonderful burrito. Hey, so I'm gonna do something a little weird. Can I get a burrito double wrapped, but can I have everything in it? Like everything, all the meats, all the beans, everything. Like an ultimate burrito or something. Like all the beats, all the sides, everything. Okay, done. All right. Great. You know what? Do you want to go ahead of me? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I don't want to keep you here forever. I let the person behind me go ahead because I don't want to be that person. And do you mind if I record this? Just the you making it. Cool. Is that gonna fit? Um, no, but that's not gonna stop us. It's not gonna stop us, no. I'm gonna love to see you close that. I have no excuse to never be able to close a burrito again. <laughs> I think you might have to like double team this one. Sorry. Yeah, because this doesn't close that way. You can throw another I would shell just on top need of a that burrito else. on top of that. We're gonna need a, a third one, and we're just gonna have to do it long ways. Hold on, can we put it in this just to like see it? Yeah, that works. <laughs> Total is gonna be 2483. 24. Okay. And that's officially the most expensive burrito I've seen. Done and done. How much was it? 2483. Before that, the most expensive I've seen was 17. 17? Oh that dude has nothing on me. Yeah, you gotta beat by seven bucks right there. So I got my burrito. It is the heaviest burrito I think I've ever ordered in my life. Most expensive burrito I've ever ordered in my life from Chipotle. Um, they were like kind of amused at how big it was. I mean, that's like, I, they used three tortillas every side. They had to make some sides because they ran out. And you know, honestly, this is probably the most food I've ever eaten in my life. This is definitely more than the pizza that I ate. I, that's all I know. Okay, I can't wait to do this, guys. And I am just getting back to my apartment now, and I have this gorgeous thing next to me. So I just realized that it's probably not a good idea for me to eat this without working out. You guys know what's coming! Okay, so I remember last time I did 10 miles. I am definitely not doing 10 miles. I'm gonna do something like three today just because it's 10.30 and I'm tired 
and I'm hungry. All right, so I'm gonna get ready in my workout clothes and I am going to go down to the gym at 10 o'clock and I'm so tired and I'm hungry and I wanna eat. That's me, guys. And look, I brought my water with me this time. Okay, so you guys remember this place. I am walking to the gym and I don't know what I'm doing. It's 11 o'clock and I'm tired and sore from last time. But you know what? It's, I'm gonna get a really good stretch today as to not hurt myself as bad as I did last time. And you know what? This is gonna be okay. It's gonna all be okay in the end. So that's the second time I finished my workout in its entirety. I did all three miles. Get off the treadmill. My watch says I only did 173. So now I'm going to be walking outside in a sketchy part in LA to say the least. I'm gonna go for the rest of my jog. And if I get jumped, I promise I will try my best to get it on camera. So. Stay tuned guys, this might be my last video, let's get it! Walking down the street I'm on, I just had a really good idea. You know what'll really get me hungry and get my appetite racing so that I'll be able to put away that whole burrito? I just turned down the wrong street and this street is known for having a lot of homeless people. So, um, this is probably a really bad idea. But that's what we're here for. Let's do this. I made it to safety. Oh my god. When I was running through there, there was a guy who was getting out of his tent. And right when he got out of the doorway, I could have sworn he was like getting up. He was like standing up. And like right as I was walking by, we made eye contact and he started standing up faster. Guys, my life just flashed before my eyes. I think I'm gonna go home now. I hope I hit my three miles. Okay, so. Oh, I'm back in my apartment again. It's 11.30, I hit my three miles. I'm so tired! Okay, so I have currently awakened, and the time is 12.45. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I think it is the perfect time for a midnight snack. So without further ado, the moment you've all been waiting for. Let's do this. That thing didn't bounce at all. That was very unsatisfying, actually. But the guy at Chipotle wrote everything. I don't know if you can see that, but normally they write chicken or steak or carnitas or whatever you order. He wrote everything. You know, the best part is I have no business doing this. I don't have the metabolism nor the ability to consume this much food in one sitting. But yet here I am. I'm gonna be genuinely surprised if I finish this thing. I really am. I have some water on standby to help me choke this down. I have my pitcher over there. I have a fork and knife should I get to the end. <sighs> should I get to the end? If I learned anything from the previous mukbang, I'm probably gonna just try to eat this as fast as I can. I'm, I'm gonna try not to talk too much and I'm just gonna try to like choke this whole thing down before my body realizes what's happening to it. I forgot to mention that in this burrito, there are 3,255 calories. Each of the tortillas alone is 320 calories. That adds up to 960 calories in just the tortilla. I'm gonna take a swig of water for good luck really quick because, help. All right, let's get into this. I don't even know how to unwrap this thing. Oh, it's so big. <laughs> Look at this thing. Okay, this is my hand and I have big hands. Um, I, I don't even know how to approach this thing. Not to mention the fact that I don't even know if this thing is gonna taste good. I, I haven't even had some of the things on that menu, like sofritas, I've never had sofritas. I always get brown rice. Um, the queso, I haven't tried the queso yet. All right, I I'm gonna stop talking and I'm just gonna, yeah. 
Oh, that's really spicy. That's the hot sauces. It's really heavy and spicy too. It's really hard to chew. It is good though. I like all the meats. And that's all I taste, just the meat. <sighs> just gonna refill this. I know I'm gonna drink the whole thing. It's so spicy. I'd say I'm about a third of the way done. And I'm, I'm starting to feel it. And my nose and my, oh, there it is. The tortilla is so dense. It's the tortilla and the rice. It's all carbs. So I'm gonna, I'm not gonna make it. I'm gonna try to eat all of the inside. That's what it looks like. It looks like just a bowl. I got a fork at the ready. My water. You know, I, it doesn't even look like I'm halfway done. Only nine minutes and 30 seconds into this. can't do this. I tried. I could show you. Let me grab this. Show you exactly how much is left. Like this was a big burrito. This still looks like another burrito. Like that's the size of a burrito that you would get when you normally order from Chipotle. Maybe if I keep doing these, my stomach will expand and maybe I'll be able to eat more in a sitting. Or maybe I'll find a way to run more in the morning. You know, who knows? Or maybe I could get a friend to do this with me. I, I'm not sure, but I think that this is definitely a challenge that I'm gonna revisit later. I was defeated by the everything Chipotle burrito. I'm like, I'm panting because my mouth is on fire. I have food for another couple days, at least, if anything. Um, this is gonna take me at least two more days to eat. Honestly, I went into this not expecting to be able to eat this in one sitting. I'm kind of glad that I'm not able to eat this because I would be genuinely scared if I was able to like this is about the size of my stomach and I ate about half of it already That's enough rambling for one day. I hope you all enjoyed make sure to like and subscribe to my channel I'm gonna go hate myself really quick. So um Anyways, it's one o'clock in the morning and I have to get up early for an audition So I'm gonna get very little sleep because my stomach is gonna be trying to digest this as I fall asleep Like and subscribe to my channel and I hope you all have a wonderful day tomorrow Thank you for tuning in and make sure you stay tuned for super awesome videos coming your way Maybe some more monkeys, maybe some more Q&A's and uh, maybe something else. I mean who knows? I'm still new to this Stay tuned guys. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful day.